Sims inside finds Brown. Brown the throw down. Look out. Oh my goodness. And I think a technical foul's been called. Yeah, you don't need that. You don't need that. In a game like this, you don't want to help a club out. You made the deuce, you celebrate to yourself, and go down the other end of the floor. He throws it down, but he's going to stare at him now, and he's going to go to him. And now, you don't want to do that. Now, you do that, you know, when you're six, seven, eighth grade, this is the big time now. You don't need that. I didn't say that I wanted to be like everybody else. I said, that, I said I'm not like everybody else. Beautiful oh, move from George Floyd has begun moving forward. In the high school level, fine young men playing in the Pac-12 of late. A lot of uh, punters in college football, by the way, from down. You know how in Asheville they have the built one. No. Although Shed uh, Maxwell should be in the whole. Oh, F figures in the history of basketball. Your little guys all grown up. He's uh, in execution of the motion off aura, but the defense here and the great ball movement never touches the ground. That's Brady the miss, rebound for Brown. I miss camping, but I've been camping out in the backyard for this, but uh, well, it's needed. So know your opponent. We, uh, like, okay, let's just... But, uh, John Block, Fitzgerald, John coaches. Oh, no. By 11 here in the first half, as Matt Coleman has been a Camping World Maui Invitational in Asheville with two E's. Six in a row for... Ramey. And you know Ramey is fired up for this matchup. And Coleman with the steal. Jones. To Greg Brown! In the face of the other freshman, Kate Cunningham. Quick passes here to Craig Brown, open corner three. In the ball as well. I mean, he was the primary scorer at the beginning of the season, leaving it up for Craig Brown to put down. The inbound pass, the offense should have started right then. Coleman, great job setting that up. Longhorns looking for their first field goal. Here's Craig Brown with one of those early threes, rattles it against Baylor. He's up to eight. On his 22nd birthday, Greg Brown. Kamaka, I call him Kamaka Hepa Smart because he is an extension oh, of his coach. To, to have a coach like a Lanier around him and running a program. That's just trying to pull away. A nice feed from Coleman to Brown inside. Jones getting going. Coach Smart is going to oh. the data point for Coach Smart, and I think one of his best runs last year at the end of the season. Pressure comes in when you look at these sites and you think you may be one and done or not, but yeah, he's just a very young ball player. Yeah, he can do things like Harold. Three on the shot clock. Pass Jones. Brown swallowed. In there, you got a big fella. <laughs> hey, but that some good handles there. Brown on some of that potential lookout. Well, you only got one left, and that Sims had a couple of flashes. Junior in Ramey, and a fourth-year junior in Jones. Brown with an 18-footer, and it's gone casual like just about every coach has this year. He told us before the game that he's hoping. Oh, oh, Brown for three. Too much dribbling. Too much. And too much length, Greg. I think this is a guy, Ted, who will be playing next year professional, professionally. He's getting the right situation. He can be an NBA player. Oh, no, an explosion at the rim. Greg Brown hammering the line. Team has to get downhill with those guards. Attack the basket. Matt Coleman for the lead. The oh, my goodness. Up in the air by Greg Brown. Nimhard has missed nine straight. Greg Brown putting it down. Help, then you can play drive and kick. Making a difference and making it hard on the opposition. School against Big 12 level competition, and that was not what Greg Brown faced. He's got another. And you'd rather have more time for the player to work it out, and then the, the school gets a year of service out of him. It just doesn't make a whole. Look at Greg Brown here. He does this guy dirty, dude. Oh, my goodness. Putting his defender on a poster right there. That's a monster jam hanging in the air.
Texas winning this one 91-55. That's the only highlight you needed to see, man. That is an incredible dunk.